all empty. You won't see this guy with the book head. Hopefully the place where we're going, it is going to be better in terms of sunlight. I always hated the lighting over here, but thank you for everything. Hey you guys, welcome back to the review. I hope you're doing very, very nice. Welcome to the moving and setting up of the best room I have ever, ever had brought. This is going to be my new room. Hello. I'm gonna have a big mirror and all. This whole wall is gonna be filled with books. And this wall is going to be filled with books. This is where the bed will be. And I'll put frames here. So then I'll have three walls where I can shoot. And we have the sun here, which is the best thing. I'll finally have some sun to myself. Myself. Okay, I don't understand anything. This is one, and this is two, but it has way too many holes. How does this hair go in the wall? Like this. And Nietzsche, like this. It needs to be sturdy. You can't build it sturdy. I can. You can't. It's there's not just this, taking and there's screws. Huh? I will do it myself. You can't. I will. You so, does this make sense? I woke up, I had coffee, breakfast, but majorly, major part of that is iced coffee. I have cold, I shouldn't be having iced coffee, but I still had it. Please ignore the mess in the back right now. You're gonna see a gorgeous room in some time. Yesterday, I tried to assemble the bookshelf, which was like this, like this, like this, like this. And guess what? I did it, you guys, I did it. I have never ever in my whole life assembled any piece of furniture before. This is the first time. I am so happy that it's a bookshelf. I am so happy that I actually did it. It it was kind of fun. And I think I'm gonna do this way more often now. But today's agenda finally is to assemble all the bookshelves, not assemble all the bookshelves, but like get all the bookshelves set. Now, let me show you. We have this one bookshelf that is supposed to go in a corner. Then we have this and we have like these two, right? We have two and two, four more of these in here. We have these shelves, which I don't know if I'm gonna use at all, but we do have it. I got it in the other house. And then obviously we have this one big bookshelf. The shelves are not in here. So we have to set up the shelves and these are all the books three cartons one book bag this and we also have a few books in the bed because i do have a vision and we have to see how it comes out this is the window okay so this is where the sunlight is going to come this is the whole wall that because the sunlight comes from here like this this bookshelf is going to remain where it is like a little more on this side the zigzag one can go over there in the corner we can have these ones three over here lined up and then we can have this and then i have a huge mirror because excuse me i have to take like a million selfies every day in my mirror so yeah the huge mirror is gonna go over there and then we have this wall which is completely plain so we're gonna put three of these over here in like a zigzag manner now let me also give you a little bit of brief of what is actually going on so let me just trace that a little bit as to what happened but before i tell you the story can we please witness my i'm gonna go like really bad so you can see the whole thing this is future until I didn't really get good shots of my outfit. So I am putting this in. It is all, it's all Mickey Mouse comics. It's super like oversized, super amazing and I love it. 
I love it so much. Anyways, talking about what actually happened. So the thing is that our old house kind of sucked. At least for me, like it sucked a lot actually. First of all, I did not really like the vibe of the house. But at the same time, there was no sunlight. That house was like always like so dark, always so freaking dark. It was like... And I was not able to shoot properly. My room was not really set up. That's the reason I did not have like a room tour or something. I was not able to decorate it because of how it was made. Like I had no plain walls over there. I had no sunlight. Every time I tried to shoot near my bookshelf, like it would, it would be just like really, really grainy. So it became like very difficult for me to actually shoot a well lit video, which I love to do. I love it when my videos are well lit, which is, which is what is going to happen in this house now, which I'm really, really excited about. And I bought all these bookshelves and I was like you know let's make the best out of the situation because I can do that because I'm amazing and that is the reason I thought that I'll buy the bookshelf and I buy the stickers I know for a fact that you guys did not like the setup also in that house and every single time I used to get a comment as to you know like we don't like the sticker or like I don't know like stuff like that I used to feel like yes yes, yes, yes I know I and I'm so, so sorry about, about it the fact that my bookshelves weren't in my room they were in another room and I was not able to see them all the time all of this really mattered to me a lot and i could totally get what you guys were saying and i was like okay fine you know what i'm gonna buy bookshelves and i'm gonna buy stickers and i'm gonna set up my entire room also like my bedroom where i will have some books and i will set up the entire like the other room where i shoot also properly so that i'm able to shoot properly and stuff but after i bought all of that and after like 20 30 days of that my parents told me that they don't really like the house either this whole sunlight thing that i have that i need sunlight and i thrive in sunlight and everything i get from my parents they are also like that they have they always need sunlight like we love sunlight 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 sunlight, 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 sunlight. i have said sunlight 2000 times they were also not liking the vibe of the house the house was really nice it was actually bigger than this house but we still prefer this house over that because of how it is made according to our needs we love this house so much and that's the reason we decided to shift i did not want to shift again but then my dad was like just see the house once and i was like papa i cannot believe you're doing this to me again my entire uploading schedule and everything is going to be ruined because of you and he was like just see the house once and if you don't like it we won't show and i saw the window and i saw my room and i saw i have three walls whenever i shoot in this room there will like no noise will go outside in the other house i was like always scared because the room where i used to shoot the door wouldn't close because it couldn't close there was some, there was something wrong with it basically i'll be able to shoot happily over here that is the reason we moved now we have all the space i am I really think that my room is gonna look really pretty. It's gonna look very bookish. Like you're gonna smell books in the room. My room is a mess right now. So I'm gonna set up the room a little bit in a way that it's comfortable for us, not us, for them to finish their work with ease. <laughs> that these people have and doing all of this on my own i don't know why this is literally the first time i've been so involved 
first of all this is the first time i'm decorating my room to like such an extension i'm seeing them using the drill and all and i can see how they're doing it and the process makes sense and i'm they're like measuring and stuff and it's like they're creating it's a process of creation which is beautiful and i feel like also doing all of this stuff i don't know honestly instead of getting better the condition of the room has become worse and there's the beautiful sun pouring in my room which is amazing uh, i would set up the books right now but it's evening time it's around 6 p.m right now which is insane it has taken so much time to get done with all of this and i still have a lot of work to do i've not worked since morning i mean like the you know like the mail and everything and i also have to edit a vlog that's supposed to go live this saturday so if you've not watched the vlog you should because i tried reading lolita again i'm actually going to set up all of this stuff which is and I have to change the bed sheet and everything. I'm kind of like going to set up the room right now instead of setting up my bookshelves and do the dusting and everything and jhadu and everything. And then I'm going to take a shower. I'm going to have food. I'm really hungry and thirsty and everything. And we will set the books tomorrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I tried really, really hard to convince myself that I do not need to do this today. Like I got really tired yesterday. I edited the vlog half. Apparently editing vlogs is so much more difficult than editing like, you know, me standing and talking. I always thought vlogs are going to be easier. I thought that I'll just add all the clips that I have taken and it's going to be like seamless and it's going to be amazing. But you actually have to put like a lot of thought into editing a vlog and i was so tired and i was not able to sleep at night yesterday thinking about all the like how amazing my room is going to look with all the books in the shelf and all like and then i woke up late and i was like maybe i don't need to do this today i can do this tomorrow or i can do this on monday so then i kept procrastinating and procrastinating and now it's 4 p.m but then i'm like let me just get a little bit of work done at least get the books on the shelf i also do have to stick the stickers that I got, like the wall stickers. Maybe I'll do that at night or I'll do it tomorrow, but we are gonna try our best to do whatever we can. My usual approach to setting my box has been taking out all the books from the carton and then I set it one by one. But then that approach hasn't really helped me a lot in the past, which is why I'm thinking we're gonna try a new, a different approach today. Just I'm gonna get one carton by one and instead of like putting it all together, setting it up on the floor and then putting it in the shelf, I'm just gonna pull it on the shelf like from the carton itself and it'll be like more like a jigsaw puzzle. So whatever pieces I get, I'm gonna use it and I'm gonna stick them together. And then I'm gonna wait for the next piece that I can find that I can stick together with that. And meanwhile, work on the other part of the puzzle, if that makes any sense. But that's what we're gonna do right now. You know what I'm the happiest about? These shelves, okay, these ones. I can actually put my Harry Potter set on a single shelf at this point like one shelf dedicated to harry potter instead of putting it among other books it's like my whole harry potter collection was getting lost and now i'll have a dedicated space and i'm so excited about it okay you guys i have the first stack of books it's all thrillers i'm gonna put it on these gorgeous black shelves for the first time let's see how that looks This book is kind of thick. I feel like it's a really good individual book to stay in a shelf. So I'm gonna put it on the top there. You know what? It's actually gonna take me a little bit of time to understand exactly how I wanna keep the books. So I'm gonna time lapse it a little bit because it's awesome. I love seeing people organize their books and I don't want to miss the chance for myself because this is also kind of like a memory of the first, you know, the kind of room that I want. So I want to time lapse it. Now I have one bag 
and I have a few books inside the bed. The good thing is I feel like I have space to buy new books and put them in the shelf. Maybe, maybe not. But for today, the sun is setting. Uh, I'm probably gonna take a break and then get back to this and I'll probably show you guys the final look tomorrow. Alright you guys, this is three days later. The room is almost done. All we have to do is put on the stickers and I am ready to do that today. It has been so many days and my nose is still stuffy and I was like thinking about it. I feel like I have some sort of allergy like dust allergy or something because of which this is happening and not actually cold. So like I got cold because of the allergy. Okay, so we have two stickers. One is this, okay, and it looks like this can you see it yeah it looks like this this area where like we have the bookshelf and the shelves it feels pretty colorful on its own i'm thinking of not doing anything on this side and then we have this sticker this is just like one half we have more of it and it looks like this is it visible okay i think that's the only amount of focus i can get but yeah this is what it looks like this wall over here looks a little empty i am gonna start from that corner and i'm gonna start like adding the branch and all and most of the leaves are going to spread throughout the wall and i wanted the whole room to come together which is why i've decided that most of these petals will go on that wall but then a few of the petals will crawl and then starting to creep on on in this side over here we will have a few petals so it'll be like cherry blossom leaves are flying in my room the whole time and my room gets really sunny like beautifully sunny the golden hour is so perfect in this room in that time this is gonna look gorgeous now the thing is that i have to put this sticker but where do i put this one but then that one is gonna be like so perfect with the sakura leaf i can put it over here but then over here, that area is never going to come into any angle whatsoever if i'm shooting from here like this also and if i like put it over here should i put this in the hallway not the hallway why do i keep calling it the hallway like over here did i put it over here on this wall no what if i put it here how on earth will that ever come in a video never i don't think we can decide where this is going till we see what the sakura one looks like what if i put it on the bookshelf so when i'm shooting like this which is never gonna happen why will i ever shoot like that yeah if i'm shooting like this and i am here no cluttered i can put it on this wall this wall is empty it's not broad enough oh my god where do i put it where do i put it over here okay let's put the cherry blossom thing I love this room so beyond much and the sun is really coming on my face right now. It's the golden hour and the room looks the prettiest. Actually, I should take a picture of this shadow also. But yes, thank you so much for watching the video. Uh, you guys are going to get some beautiful videos now. And I am here to please your eyes with my books on a weekly basis. If you do like the video, like, share, subscribe. I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye.